What is going on guys? I am back. We are 21 days into my current water fast, which means 10 more days to go. 10 more days of this to go. And I must say like I'm at that stage now where I feel like I can't even drink any more water. Like I can't like I think yesterday I must have had less than less than a litre I had yesterday I think I'm at that point now where I don't know like imagine you I, bear in mind I'm not a water lover anyway but imagine you had something that you love like imagine pizza for example and someone said you could only eat pizza now for a month you had to have it morning noon and night every day for 31 days I'm pretty sure that it would be long before day 21 where you think I can't have any more pizza anymore I'm done I'm done I'm game over but I don't know maybe you're watching this because you're fat and because you could probably eat pizza for all that time I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know no fat shaming around here but seriously guys I am on that home stretch and by saying it's a home stretch there's still 10 days that's not a home stretch to me but um yeah I'm 10 days left to go time for the update um, and just gonna give you a body update first. So you've already seen the physique update from the edit. Uh, I'm gonna update you on little things that have changed. So if you can see my tongue. It's now starting to like, my breath starting to smell more frequent more often so i'm brushing my teeth like i'm brushing my teeth like twice a day but i'm mouth washing like five times a day which well, basically whenever i go to the toilet i'm banging in some mouthwash i don't know like i don't think anyone else can smell it but you know when like you consciously smell it or like you know when like you smell a smell and therefore like you're like is that me is that is that me so I'm at that stage. Um, that's not that's not cool, but it's part of the process. Again, it means stuff's working. Uh, my rash. So update on the rash. Uh, update on the rash. Um, I don't know how it looks compared to last week, but what I will say is that this week I've. Um, it didn't, it, so like, I think literally the day after I start, I filmed the last video, um, the rash that was keeping me up all night kind of stopped and I felt it was like drying out. Um, so yeah, it just kind of dried itself and cured itself a little bit. And then lo and behold, last night, that bitch came back. So that's, that's the rash um, update. But it's going, like, it's gone off my face. It was, it was on my face a bit last time round. That's gone. Uh, but while you're here, you are here for... Why does my chair keep... Da -da 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 -da. I must still be fat, like my chair keeps running away from me. So, we are here for the numbers to see where we are. We are officially 21 days in. And I'm gonna do the little graph that I did last week because I thought that, that was pretty cool and I was quite happy with myself. Uh, 16 stone today. So, hey Siri, what is 16 stone in pounds? 16 stone is 224 pounds. What's 16 stone in kilos? What's 16 stone in kilos? The answer is 101.6 kilograms. So yeah. That's what I'm wearing at the moment. Um, remember, like when I started, I was I was around 19 stone, so I've lost like three stone now in 21 days, three weeks. Not bad, on track. So I'm now at a point where I'm I'm like I'm so bored of drinking water. Like I am so bored of drinking water. I would do anything right now for like a Lucas Aid or like I'm looking over there. And I can see some like Ribena and you know, you're just like, oh, I could, maybe if I just poured some of that in, but I'm not, I'm not gonna break. Um, let me give you an update on my week. 
So I, don't, I know that people in the comments have been asking like, how much are you working out? What have you been doing? Can you work? So, cause there's not really much to go on on this. I'm gonna answer some of the questions from the last video. So, um, let's get over to those. So, one of the main questions I got last time around in the last video was, have you been working out? So up until the last video, uh, I think I even said it in the last video actually, I hadn't worked out at all. Because when I did my last fast, I noticed that there were just days where my weight was all over the place. And I think that was because I was probably building muscle, then losing fat, and the weights were all over, so I couldn't really gain it. So, so this time around, I have, the first two weeks I didn't work out at all. Last, pardon me, last week, Monday, Tuesday, no, I, I did the video last week, Monday, so last week, Tuesday, I did my first workout. I got a new, like, I got a gym now in the garage, so I haven't go so far for my workouts. Um, I've been doing, like, 20-minute workouts for, like, like weight, obviously weights, um, quite heavy considering I haven't worked out for a while, um, but just been smashing a couple of body parts, like, kind of, well, I've been smashing body, actually, all over, mainly, like, chest, back, um, arms, I've been doing that. I would say in the last week, I think I've done three or four. Four, I think I've done four. I did Tuesday, Wednesday, I think I was off Thursday, and Friday, Saturday. So, and then yesterday, I was KO'd. Like yesterday, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna admit now, yesterday was a hard day for me, like a very hard day. I struggled a lot. Um, I felt that I needed to eat so bad, but they were like just cravings. And I don't know if you get if you ever got this before, but like I felt sick in my stomach. But obviously, there's nothing to sick up, so like it was mainly just stomach lining. Um, and I wasn't being sick. I wasn't trying to be sick. But you know when you have that feeling like, oh, I'm gonna throw up. Like maybe if you're drunk a lot or whatever. I was having that. I was going through that motion but I didn't want to be sick. That's like, I feel like I could taste. I could taste my insides yesterday and that was just making me feel sick. So like yesterday, I just didn't really leave bed. Yes, it was a Sunday, so it's all good. What do you do on a Sunday anyway? So next question, uh, I've, I've worked out. Um, I've got David Liverpool. He was saying the rash, the rash is just your body detoxing, which is what I already knew, which is good that other people are backing up. So thanks, Dave. Um, research liver and gallbladder flushing. So that's something for me to look into. He's saying that he's done that in the past. He does about four flushes, four flushes, sorry, a year, and he doesn't get any kind of types of those symptoms while he's water fasting. So definitely gonna check that out. Thank you, David. Um, educate cluster. He's saying um, take the fast to your at 25 BMI. Um, and then when you do that, when you start to feel faint or lightheaded, then drink some snake juice. So again, like everybody's on this snake juice. Like I said, I'm not gonna do any snake juice and at this point, not I don't think. However, my next fast, because I'm sure there'll be another one in the future, that might be what my next fast is. Um, take your weight to 25 BMI. I actually would love to do that. Um, I think one of the things that's challenging me at the moment is I know I have like a family dinner on the 2nd of Feb. So that's kind of why I said I'll do the month. In reality, I kind of don't want to go to that family meal um, because I do think that I could keep going, but I can't not go. So that's the that's the plan. I know that if I get to a certain weight, that's going to motivate and push me more. So as bored as I am now drinking water, I know that that motivational thing might be what gets me there. So. We'll have to keep a look out for that. But yeah, it looks like 2nd of February, I'm eating either way. Uh, who's this? Decide motivation. He's a hi Shane, I'm the one that commented on your other video. I'm following you, subscribe. Thank you for subscribing. And if you haven't subscribed already, please make sure you do so. It really helps the channel, it helps me out. It gives me motivation. I kind of stopped um, vlogging last year because like YouTube just kept moving the goalposts and then when they said you now need like a thousand subs to be monetized and I broke my ass to get to their previous um, goals it really put me off so 
please help me get to a thousand and then we can go from there. And I just want to thank everyone while I'm here for the support I've had so far. But please subscribe because you don't, I don't think you understand like each subscriber when you wake up in the morning, you've got even if it's like one or two subs that that motivates you like it might seem so irrelevant to you but it actually motivates the hell out of you so thank you for everyone that has and if you haven't already please subscribe like please um and where was he so he's unsubscribed um i'm doing fantastically again thank you thank you for everyone that's complimenting me there's been a lot of compliments in the comments so thank you um keep going i agree about day three it's so important to get to day four and five. That's when you get into real deep ketosis. Remember, I've said that a lot about getting into that deep ketosis. Once you can reach that, that's when you start to see those changes. That's when your, your mind focuses in a different way. That's when your body starts to adapt and change. So these are the numbers like you've really got to look at getting to. So guys, all you people that are um, getting to day three and quitting, please, please get to days four and five, like please. Um, but yeah, he agrees with the state of eupho euphoria. Um, so definitely thank you for your comments. So uh, the next name I think is Dajay or Dej or Dejay. Um, Sorry in advance for butchered your name, but again, I just want to thank you. You've been very supportive. I've noticed you in the comments and you said uh, you're doing great, Shane. Uh, I know the rash sucks, but it's good for you that you're pushing through it. Um, I have to settle for a vegetarian OMAD th this month in preparation for a water fast next month. So I honestly wish you so much luck in your water fast next month. If you need any support, just drop me a message. I'll always respond and I'll always give you that advice that you need if you're not getting the advice you need from these videos, which I'm hoping is the point. Um, they were like the, quest, the main questions on the last video, but on the original video I did, that's when I got a lot more views. So let's look at some of those questions. I want to shout out Nancy, by the way. So um, I assume you're American because you've gone, I love your video, Shane. I, I could listen to you talk all day. I love your accent. Good luck on your fast. So thanks for the good luck. And I must say, like, if you are American, just know that when I do go to America, I actually speak more like this and I'm far more proper because, you know, it's just the right thing to do. Um, but yeah, that one's for you, Nancy. Um, people are asking, you know, am I keeping up with the vlogs? Obviously, yes, because they've been coming out weekly. Um, congrats on the baby, the home and the business. Thank you, Treehouse Lover. Um, yeah, thanks. Thanks. Um, like I said, last year was such a like, it wasn't a tough year. It was just like a chaotic year. And like I said, I didn't put that weight on until like literally like September, October, like September, I think it started to creep back on. October was when I started to notice it. And then like November was when I just started to not give a fuck. Cause I was like, I'll just do another fast. Um, so yeah, like, thank you for that. Thanks for the encouragement. Thanks for the understanding. Uh, but this time, 2019, the weight is staying off. Um, I got Eddie Thompson, he's asking what brand of water do I drink? So I've been combining like tap water when I'm, when I'm using my bottle, obviously it's just tap water. Um, but mainly I drink Evian. I, I, I drink my tap water once a day or once every two days i'd say and now i'm not like now i'm at that point where i can taste the difference i'm drinking it a lot less um so like yesterday like this is still left over from yesterday and i've still got like 750 mil over 750 mil so um i'm not really drinking a lot of tap water evian is my brand of water that's what i like i can taste the difference in other brands and i don't like a lot of other brands i'm quite picky with my water i can literally just taste like impurities in what is supposed to be pure water um da -da 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 -da. A lot of people talking about like they're starting their fast, so they're starting their fast either tomorrow or next week or next month. So again, like again, for all you people, good luck. If you need anything, I'm here. Um, I'll keep bringing out videos. I'm gonna probably do another video soon, which is more around um, how to fast, how to prep for it. What I do, like when I, when I know I'm gonna do a fast, I know I'm doing a fast. Therefore, I know how I'm gonna prep in my mind, 
what I'm gonna get out of my system in terms of like, I need to eat some crap just to get it out of my system. Um, and then how I am mentally prepared throughout it, what I'm doing throughout it, what my tips and tricks are to make sure I don't break. Um, so I'll probably do another one of those videos. Again, subscribe so you can see that. Um, Turn on that, like hit that bell so you get the notifications as soon as they come out. Natalia TT, this is sick, well done. You're, I'm on day 10 uh, and I feel like shit. <laughs> it's so freaking hard. Aiming for 25 days, but I'll settle for 21. Uh, that was a week ago, so I really hope you're still going. I hope you feel better. Uh, I hope you're still pushing through. Uh, yeah, like, good, good, good. Someone uh, has, has put, um, are you a food journalist? Or food critic. I wouldn't call myself a food, a food journalist or critic. So I have my own company, which is like a, a brand management company, and we do tend to manage um, people in hospitality, which is mainly like food, drink, lifestyle, um, and stuff like that. However, on my personal Instagram, so at Shane Williams, check me out and sub uh, follow me on Instagram. I am a foodie, like I'm a food blogger. I wouldn't call myself a blogger. Um, I don't write about the food, but I go and eat a lot of food. Um, I recommend what's good for you, like what's good, like what food you'd like um, or what I like. Uh, and yeah, my, my page is mainly food porn. I'd say I know a lot about food. Uh, I understand f the food game. I'm passionate about food. Would I say I'm a food journalist or a critic? Uh, no, I'm not there to criticize the food. I'm just there to enjoy it. Food is one of my pastimes. Like, um, I, I noticed when I did my first fast and I'm noticing now, I love the social aspects of food. So I love like the whole going out and enjoying the atmosphere of a place. Like to me, the food experience isn't just the taste of the food. It's what's the service like? What's the uh, atmosphere like? You know, have they thought about this? Have they thought about that? I suppose that does make me sound like a bit of a critic, but yeah, I'm not a critic, but maybe kind of, I don't know. I don't get paid to critique. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's pretty much that. That's just much of the update I can probably give you for now. I'm gonna probably do some more videos this week. As you can see in my face, like, I don't know if you can notice, but like in my neck, I feel a lot slimmer in my face. I can start to see my jawline starting to come through. So I'm a lot more comfortable on camera now. So I'm probably gonna start getting the camera out a bit more over the next week to 10 days. So rather than like a weekly update, you might get um, a few more than that. Or like I said, I might just drop some videos in between. So, so guys, leave a comment, obviously in the comment uh, section, what you wanna see, if there's any videos that you want me to do that I haven't done yet, more than the updates, or is anything I can do to help you with your fast, um, let me know and I'll just either round some questions up and put them together or I'll do whatever you're you know, suggesting if it's pretty cool. So I'll do that. And um, I think I wanna finish on one final thing. I watch a hell of a lot of YouTube per day and usually I'm watching like entrepreneurs, the odd food, I watch like lots of different, like lots of different stuff like, and I've noticed that I can, I can honestly tell you, I've been watching at least 12 hours a day of mukbangs, food tours, um, like food, uh, food speed challenges, like so many, everything I watch at the moment is just food, 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 food. So at the moment, I just wanna like travel the world and stuff my face with food. But for some reason, I feel like I'm vicariously eating through others. And I think that's what's kind of keeping me sane. So um, I think it's really interesting that people are watching my videos while they're fasting to keep them sane, but I'm watching like people eat food to keep me sane. So like when my partner's eating, I literally take the food or like I literally just take the food and like, and like I have to smell it as if like I'm ingesting it. Like, oh, like that's me at the moment. Like, is that weird? Like, please comment and tell me that's either super weird or like that makes sense. You Shane, you're not going mad. But yeah, like I just thought I'd close off with that. Um, in my head, I think it's, you know, Part funny, part cuckoo. Uh, but let me know your thoughts, guys. And until the next video, I just wanna thank everybody for all their support, all their comments. We are free stone down in 21 days and we're still going. Let's like, imagine I can get down to like, so like tomorrow I'm gonna be in the 15s, 15 stones. 
imagine in the next 10 days, it's not unrealistic that I'm gonna be at like 14 stone, which means I kinda wanna get to 14 and a half stone, because I know once you start eating, you put on naturally, like, uh, you put on about four to six pounds naturally. So I'm thinking if I get to 14 and a half stone, that's, that's like now my new goal, I'll be walking around at 15 stone. That'll be sick. Um, so wish me luck, let's do this. And I will see you soon. Thanks, guys. Peace.